the world is spinning and I am in control. I am the master of the universe. All is known to me. If heaven above can be measured, and the foundations of the earth searched out beneath, I will also cast off all the seed of Israel for all that they have done, saith the Lord. Real quickly, I'm going to go over why I believe stellar parallax is impossible. Basically what it is is when the earth is at one point, you measure a star, you figure out where it is in the sky, and six months later you measure it again. I'm going to use Alpha Centauri as the example. They say it's the closest star. They claim it's 25 trillion miles away or 4.3 light years away. Okay, so if the Earth is at one point and then six months later it's at another point, that means it's about 186 million miles away if the Sun is 93 million miles away. Okay, so you divide 25 trillion by 186 million and you get about 130,000. Okay, so that means it's 130,000 miles away for every one mile apart. Okay, if you got point A, point B, it's one mile apart. This is equivalent to measuring something that's 134,000 miles away. Okay, we'll break that down even more. If you divide that by by the number of feet, you're going to get about 25 miles per foot. So point A and point B is a foot apart. You're looking at an object 25 miles away. Or if you break that down even more, you're measuring something that is an inch apart. Point A, point B is an inch apart looking at something that is two miles away. All right, here is a shot from uh, an airplane 25 miles roughly above the earth. Okay, so if you're one if your point A is one inch away from point B and you're trying to use that as your basis for measurement when looking at an object that's two miles away I, I don't believe that's possible I don't even think that's even close to being possible that would be equivalent to looking at an object two miles away and being able to discern an inch the gods are always watching they can hear us.